Deathrow Knights and Dragons is a brand new DC anime film, which is actually episodes of like an internet web series that they did, uh, you know, the, earlier this year. They did, these are episodes of web series that they did that was on the CW, like, online site. Instead of putting it as a box set, they just pieces it together and call it a movie because they're like, I don't know, 20 minutes long and there's like six episodes. So it's like, let's just call it as a movie. And here's the thing, like, me who has finally saw it, I, I was kind of, my expectations of it was, okay, this is going to just be Deathstroke who just killing and murdering people. It's going to be like that Mortal Kombat Stormy as Avenged film where it was like going to be a lot of action and a little on story. Well, I was wrong about that. <laughs> I mean, there's a lot of violence and there's a lot of gore and it's Deathstroke doing his thing and Deathstroke doing his thing is always wonderful to watch. But it this is a movie that has heart. It has story. It has relationships of Slade of his election between his sins with his family with the life he has chosen his you know totally and mentally um the con the relationship between his son and his his wife and and all the drama and all the baggage that he has done onto them and the choices that he's done as a father as a husband the whole idea of like he's a mercenary and he kills people but how does he de justify that he's killing the right people kind of thing you know he's killing like there's a sequence about 20 minutes in where he's killing a bunch of people and we find out oh because of sex traffickers and it's like well i kill these fucking sex traffickers that makes a you know what i'm doing okay while you had this wonderful scene between his wife where he's like, No it ain't Slade. No is it uh you serious Deadpool you <laughs> if you don't know the story, the uh creator of Deadpool was a massive fan of Deathstroke, but they were contracted by Marvel so they kinda of made a essentially someone one draw you know one to Deathstroke but they couldn't because they were working at Marvel so they decided to make Deadpool. Um a set uh, Slay Wilson, it's Ray Wilson, you know, um, it's, you know, it's at, uh, Black and Orange, it's, uh, wet, Black and, it's, uh, wet and black, like, you, you, you get the drift, yeah, you get the drift, okay, good, um, but yeah, this movie has, there's a lot of it, the action's fantastic, by the way, the music is fantastic, um, this is a movie that I would really recommend to people who may have seen, you know, the character on Arrow or Titans or uh, or that little snippet in Justice League that we'll probably get more in the Snyder Cut. Um, it's just... I'm... I just... It, what, was surprised watching it. And the twist of the turns and how a Vespa how invested I am with these with the characters where certain things happen I feel the the weight of it and I felt the states of it or I was like getting pumped along with with the action it's like you know you get him slain and all that I, I, I try not to hit spoilers but it's really well done it's absolutely well done um yeah recommend it 100